Hello guys, this is Piri and uh, welcome to another game of Scrolls. So, um, I just did a recording of Scrolls and I thought, oh, why not do a couple more, you know. Uh, I got money to buy some more Scrolls, so uh, let's start by doing that and then we'll go into uh, a ranked game. So let's do that, let's go to the store. And uh, uh, what I'm trying to do is, instead of spending money on the specific... Um, scrolls you know for each of the of the factions what I'm doing is actually as I started as a growth deck what I've been trying to do is get as many cards as possible so I can build other types of decks or even a multicolor deck so uh, I'm normally buying only um, this uh, scroll pack that brings uh, 10 cards and uh, one rare and two uncommon and then the rest is common so let's do the right that let's do that and uh, see what we get Alright, so this is good. I think I have a couple of them already. Uh, I like this spell. Yeah, I got this, so not that good. This is kind of good. Uh, not so good. I got enough. I got enough. This is nice for the white deck. Alright, the uncommon card. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Yeah, I see a lot of people using this. Uh, I haven't played energy, uh, but uncommon so and I got another one of uh, the wild uh, I, I actually think I have three already let's see the rare and I don't know this what is it end of all reason sacrifice all units you control with a non-zero countdown each unit sacrifice this way dealt two damage to the opponent units on the same row ah, that's kinda good even though you gotta it's like uh, a cleaning um, board kind of spell because you sacrifice your own creatures to do damage to the others but it has to be with zero cooldown so I don't think I got anything uh, good on this 10 cards but it's uh, 10 extra cards that I got and just to show you guys how much cards I have at the moment um, I'm going on 97 on growth I got 52 on energy and 49 on order so I've been playing a bit and I've been buying a couple of uh, boosters. Um, i also been selling a couple of cards, haven't done any tradings, but um, uh, that's like it. Maybe I can find a couple of people online uh, and trade a bit, you know. Because there's a couple of cards that I would like to have on my, on my growth deck. Uh, so let's do a game. Let's do a rank match. Currently 745 on ranking, uh, and as I said, I haven't lost uh, a rank match yet. Mm. I did a couple, I would say a couple of of games on quick match. I did a couple of trials already. Um, I think the only ones missing are the. Um, oh, it was a bit too fast. Not accepting or something. Um, the only trials I didn't do uh, or didn't complete yet um, are most of the hard ones that are really, really really hard to do but they give excellent amount of money so from time to time I just go there and try to do the trials uh, so let's see if we got a game come on wait ah, here we go alright so uh, Good luck, sir, and let's see um, how we do on this one. All right, so he's the first one playing. I don't necessarily feel like being the first one is better, cause uh, you get one uh, less card. Uh, what am I going to sacrifice? Yeah, this. And w when when you have to sacrifice cards for for uh, points to be able to summon things, um, having one less card might be you know you it might be the difference between throwing out something that you want and uh, and something that you don't want. All right, so let me see what I'm gonna do. I'm definitely gonna kill this one and don't even care about that one there. So I'm gonna sacrifice this poison spell on that one straight away, and we're done. 
Alright, alright, alright. So that one, uh, I'm gonna press control so you guys can see the points. Um, this one is gonna die next turn unless he does uh, some kind of enchantment to it that increases the uh, the life points of it. But when you're playing against um, order, you never know what they're gonna put in. They got a lot of creatures that, in my opinion, are some of the best in the game. Uh, what is that? Yeah. Uh, it, when it gets destroyed, he's gonna get one extra order point, so that's pretty good. But he's down to one card, and and that is not definitely not good for him. Uh, so let me see now. I'm definitely putting this one away. Summon this one here. One extra card. Yeah, that is good. That's definitely good. All right, so. The big threat on the field is now eliminated. Um, my plan is, and so you guys know it, un unless something real. Ah, okay, so I couldn't do my plan. I was planning on sacrificing that card next for uh, three extra cards. Uh, so that did not work. Didn't work, so. Um, it's down to one card, so that is good for me. Uh, at least for now. So let me put a uh, wolf into play. And uh, I don't know if he's going to sacrifice it to deal like two damage and then use a spell to deal one extra damage there. Yeah, those, those these are the cards that I wanted to talk with you about uh, regarding order. This cards that have spike two is basically when I attack with a card of mine and and deal damage to the card. This card in returns deals two damage to whatever is attacking it. So it's pretty. Um, bad because it, it has a lot of defense, it doesn't have that much attack, but he basically uses this as walls and then he places the creatures that attack behind it and that is a bit problematic. So let me see, I don't want to attack with this one, what I'm gonna do is get an extra point here and use this one to attack it. This is gonna suffer two damage but it's gonna deal three and if it, with one card, I'm just trying to control the amount of creature he has on the board, you know. I'm still at uh, at, um, at a better situation than he is. You see what I mean? Now, he's placing more and more and more. And the more he has on lines, the more um, it will help him uh, uh, increase the, the, st the statistics on, on each of its uh, creatures. So. Now I'm a bit on on a, a situation here. This ones aren't going to attack next turn. This one is. I might, I might sacrifice this for an extra point and just buy the cards. I think that is exactly what I'm going to do. I need more cards than anything else, so I'm going to place this there, buy one card. Yeah, I definitely did a good choice. And then sacrifice that for free extra. And uh, we are done. That one is gonna be out. This one is gonna attack next unless he deals something he does something to it. So it's one less creature he's gonna have. And he's probably gonna defend this one. But this one can be killed by this one next turn. So alright, so it, it's not as I planned. Uh, um, so I gotta see what I'm gonna do here. Alright, so putting this creature now would kill this one here, but then it will die this. Uh, actually, it will pass more damage than anything. Hmm. Alright, so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to. I'm going to uh, yeah that's what I'm gonna do I'm gonna sacrifice five like this put this back put this creature on and then place a for um, one of this one was called Ilforn um, basically I'm gonna kill this one this is gonna attack deal one damage here uh, uh, free here one here and deal and suffer one damage in return so let's do this let's do this it still has one card so 
now he has two, probably three if he sacrifices uh, it for a car, but I'm doing a good job in controlling the, the creatures he has on the board. Yeah, he still puts more and more and more. It's, it's just how it rolls. And now I am done with two of these creatures, man. Damn it. That was a good card for him. I'm sacrificing for more cards, definitely. Alright, so let me think now. Um, he's gonna attack in two turns. Uh, 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 um. Right, four, six, seven. I think I'm gonna do exactly that. Yeah, why not? Put this one here. Uh, this one here. I didn't want to spend this here, but I think I might. Because there's not much reasoning at the moment behind this, because I'm going to lose an attack anyway. It's just... It's just... Because this is going to take... Man, that's a bummer. Where did you place the enchantment? There. Uh, 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 uh. Alright, I think I'm gonna do one thing. He placed an enchantment that enchanting unit is increased by one damage deal to it. So, what I'm gonna do, this is spiky, man. Spiky, spiky, spiky. So, if I deal one damage to each of my creatures. Yeah, look at this, guys. This is how it's gonna roll, right? I'm going to... This one is gonna attack here. It's gonna kill because I'm gonna use this spell. Then mine is gonna die. This one is gonna die. Yeah, and this one is gonna attack because I'm gonna place this one. I'm gonna destroy all these creatures. So, here we go. Here goes nothing. All right, before I place this, I'm gonna use this. That would be dumb of me. And now, here we go. There, we cleaned the board on there on his side. So the ball is on his part now, and uh, yeah, he sacrificed for an extra card. And unless I get something really, really good, that's what I'm gonna. Because now I need cards to. Uh, yeah, yeah, he's not. He's not. He doesn't have anything special right now. Oh, well, I'm definitely putting this on. And let's see what happens now, because I have a, a nice creature into play to deal basically with anything that it brings into the board. So, all right, he's trying to um, amass some kind of troops. Yeah, the, I hate that card. Just buys them so much time. Oh. I could use this, even though it's not going to give me too much in terms of... Right, he's going to attack next, so... I'm going to do this here. Do I really need to use this right now? Or do I need more cards? I think I'm going for more cards. It's not like I'm worried too much about this one here. Yeah, I'm going for more cards. Alright, there's nothing special here, so I'm not going to place anything on the board. Uh, maybe this one here. No, I'm not going to place anything on the board. <laughs> going to make him wonder what I have in my hand. It's not like that creature is going to be a game, a game changer, you know? Like one, it takes two turns to attack, it gives me one extra growth point, but yeah. Alright, one damage there. I can live with that. Uh, I'm gonna destroy his creature next. Hopefully. Uh, okay, I'm not. <laughs> Alright, so... 
I'm definitely using this one and definitely doing this alright so not exceptionally good cards right now but I think I'm gonna f uh, forsake these two rows up here and I'm gonna simply focus on the three bottom ones and Mm, yeah, I might place this one here now. Because now I have three cards in my hand and I don't need to have that creature there and it gives one extra uh, point to this one. So, next turn if it doesn't place anything here, this one is done for. And then I'm going to do as the previous game I did. I'm just going to go down and down and down and destroy these things here. Alright, so he's gonna sacrifice it to kill this. Is that it? Alright, free free. Ah, oh, that's a bummer. That is a bummer. But. He's not that much problematic. Um, what I'm gonna do is uh, use this spell to po pinpoint it there. So he doesn't move from there. And I'm going to focus on the free middle uh, rows. There's no point uh, buying a fight that you don't really need, you know. He has to put something to defend or he's going to die. So uh, so what I'm going to do right now is sacrifice for two cards. Oh, that, that is excellent. That is just excellent. So decreasing the movement of that unit. And I'm going to place... Instead of attacking the middle row, I'm actually going to attack the top one. Like this. And four. Like this. And eight, ten. Yeah. Well, he just surrendered. So that is a win because he saw he didn't have any chance of it. And uh, that was actually quite a quick match, 249 more gold, and I still haven't lost a game in ranked. Uh, eight, 824. I'm on 6,395 at the moment. Alright, and uh, that is it for today's game. And um, I hope that you liked it, and uh, if you are planning on buying this game, do it because you have a lot of uh, gameplay hours here and it is fun as hell. This is Piri out. See you guys on the next one. Bye.